Well, hi everybody. I just took a second to pop on a Gabor wig. We've got an hour of gorgeous, gorgeous wigs to kind of like change, you know, what your mood is that day. Maybe you didn't get to the hair salon to get your roots done, no worries. Maybe you wonder what it would look like to have that shorter haircut. Maybe you're thinking about getting bangs, but you don't wanna like wait five years to have them grow out. Or maybe you have your hair like thinning as time goes on. We've got amazing styles and beautiful wigs that are gonna start the show out with. Starting out with our first, uh, are we gonna do a, sh a shot of me? Okay, so what? here it is, the, the monitor's across the thing, I can't see, what's the name of this one? Prosperity, all right, so we're gonna go on my Facebook page and I'm gonna show you a picture of before and after. So there's the Facebook page, and again, I just have my hair back in a ponytail. I didn't feel like getting up early, washing it, setting it, styling it, teasing it. I didn't feel like spending two hours doing that today, but you know what I did feel like doing? Popping on the wig. See if you love it. And uh, these are high quality wigs. They're adjustable. They are cool and they breathe. Um, and you're, you're never gonna have to worry. By the way, I went a little bit lighter because I thought, you know, I've been going darker with my hair. I wonder what it's like going like a little bit lighter. So, so many fun things we're gonna be talking about. Um, should we bring in our special guest? All right, let's bring in our special guest, Martino Cartier. Hey, Martino, always great to see you and always so fun to talk about wigs. Hey, you look great, blonde. I was like, is that my girlfriend right now on TV? <laughs> you look so good as a blonde. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm good. You know, I've had different shades of blonde, but, you know, there's all, it's, it's so, it's not my natural color, so it's a little bit harder right. to, you know, the roots come in dark, yeah. but you can see, yep. what, I got zero roots here, boy. <laughs> this is like <laughs> perfect. I love it. And, you I know, you can fuss with it and, you know, but I'll tell you, it's just, you pop it on and the style is already there. We're gonna start out with our first style and it's called Spirit. Yes, and I, what I love about all of the wigs, including the one you're wearing right now, is that they are heat friendly. That means you can curl them, you can flat iron them, but what it also means is once they're styled, it stays that way until you put heat on it again. So for example, if you buy Spirit and you love this flip and you love that volume in the crown, it will always stay like this, even if you wash it and let it air dry. I mean, Gabor's been around for 52 years, and when they started, within one year, they became the largest wig manufacturer in the world. So 52 years of improving research and development gives you perfect hair each and every day. Each, each and every day. And you know, they're so easy <laughs> to take care of. All, you know, you just, you, you put them in a little sink with some shampoo and shake them around, you take them out. Yep. But let's go through this uh, spirit. And I we've got our gorgeous models at wearing them, so I love it. This Here are the colors. This is light blonde, and this is the color that I'm wearing today. Notice how it's not like one solid color. It's, how many, Martino, how many different colors are in here? Seven to 11 different shades within each wig color. Love it, love it. So this is light blonde. Then we go to medium uh, medium blonde, and you can see it's a little bit, almost like a little warm, little see, almost like a little red strawberry highlights. This is dark blonde, which is kind of like what my nat what my I don't want to say my natural color, what the color is that I'm wearing with my hair right now. But here's the dark blonde. Then we have light brown. This is light brown, and you see that there's different colors in here. It's not like you know all solid one color. And then we also have medium medium brown. So we're just getting a little bit, a little bit, uh, you know, a little deeper. This is dark brown here, which is like this really pretty kind of chestnutty color. And next to that is black. A true black. So you decide if you want to go, you know, go a little bit lighter or do the true black. Then we go into the red family. I've got medium red, but again, see how that's not just like solid, solid. There's like blonde highlights in it and all sorts of different colors. And then we go into light red, which is by the way, one of my favorite colors. It's like, it's like Auburn and strawberry blonde and blonde, blonde all together. And then I'll tell you, I, these sell out the fastest, the quickest. I don't care what style it is. It is the grays. We've got the brown gray, and then we've got the light gray. And the light gray is like that sassy color that all the 20-somethings, the Instagrammers, Martino, are like, please make my hair this color. I'm sure it won't damage it. I'm sure <laughs> yeah. it won't damage it, right? You could do that, right? <laughs> 
Everybody wants to be great today. Everybody, all ages. It's just been trending for like two years now, and they nailed it with this color gray. By the way, it still has seven to 11 different shades, and Inger is wearing Spirit right now. And talk about color being popular. This haircut is one of the most sought after haircuts that I get asked in our salon. I've been doing hair for 31 years, and people come in with the same picture of this famous girl. Her first name is Lisa, and they just, I, I have that picture embedded in my head because everybody loves this short haircut. Oh my gosh, Ingerbor, you look amazing. How, how, how hard is that? I know you did your own everything today. Talk yes. to us, girl. You know what I love about this wig? The <laughs> flip, it's so much fun. And I love this color. This is actually the color of my hair, the medium brown, that's what I'm wearing. And I just love, this one is the fun flip layer. So it's really very modern and it's just so much fun. And it's so easy to wear. I like the fact that um, I don't have to dye my hair when I wanna change it up. That's really wonderful. So I'm just gonna shake that one. This is actually the light red. And the tabs are already pulled in for my head size, which is small. <laughs> so easily to put on, easy to put on. Then I'm just gonna uh, center those two tabs on the side. And I'm just gonna finger style this. Very simple, very easy, and very quick. And there we go, I'm done. And, and see, look how easy that is. Now, I love this color too. It's I love beautiful. that color too, I love it. I love it, and you know, so I love fun. the back of this one too. I'd love for you to swing around because mm -hmm. the back is kind of like flirty yeah. and sassy and how it kind of comes up. And it, it's like, you cannot, honestly, I've been working for Ingeborg for like years. <laughs> I, and I, ne like, it's like, that girl changes her hair. Like some people change your nail polish. Like I would, I mean, it, and it took me a while to figure out, wait, is that a wig? You know, it's, it's and, and by the way, all these years later, Martino, Everybody wears wigs. Everybody's Absolutely. wearing wigs. Absolutely. In fact, you could watch TV all day long. And the fun, the sad thing is you can pick out a lot of the wigs because they're not made by a company that's been around for 52 years. If you look at the TV screen right now, that color looks unbelievable. Number one, it doesn't look too shiny. It actually looks like perfect shiny, healthy hair. And that's how you can tell a good wig. A good wig should have the same sheen as healthy, natural hair. You should be able to tuck it behind your ear and not see any of the construction of the wig, which you can with all of the wigs today. Look at that. That is amazing. I mean, I'm impressed and I'm selling it. <laughs> yeah, exactly. I mean, look at, you can't even uh, uh, tell. I'm sorry, what is your name? I Tessa, that's right, Tessa, I apologize. Tessa, and, and it's like, I, I honestly, like the back of her head, which one is wearing away, which one isn't? I'll tell you which one is sassy and has a lot of different colors and would be a fortune to maintain. It's the shorter sure. style, yes, right, Martino? Isn't it more expensive absolutely. to maintain a short haircut? It absolutely is, because with it, your hair grows a half inch a month. So that's a quarter inch in two weeks. So with that fun, razored, precision haircut, by the way, you need to go to someone that's really well knowledge with hair to get that kind of haircut on your natural hair. But the maintenance, the color alone, you see the color of that wig? You're gonna be getting your hair colored every four weeks. So you're getting it cut every four weeks, colored every four weeks. It's just so much. And why bother when you can just put it on and go? Yeah, and, and this is called Spirit. That is the name of this yes. particular style, Spirit. And we have it available in all the colors. Jerry, do we have all the colors in this one? Are any of them limited? I wanna make sure I update everyone. Uh, okay, light gray, there's 11 left. And what did I say at the beginning, Martino? I don't know what it is, the gray, we cannot keep it in stock. There's 11 Ever. can be ordered, 11, and then that's it. If you wanna have this gorgeous, sexy spirit short haircut in the light gray, there's only 11 of you that can get it. If we're gonna ship it to you for free, we've got FlexPay, so sure. three FlexPay, $39.67. I do wanna mention the wig stands that Martino has. There's three of them and it's only $15.50. I really encourage everyone to get a wig stand because when you when you wash it, it's nice to have it where you, hand, you where you dry it and also you're going to start you're going to start collecting them, right? Martino, you're not going to well, just get I, one. They're like potato th chips. <laughs> Listen, and they travel, they pop apart into two little pieces or they're easy to take wherever you want. But what's nice about this is that it's not going to stretch the wig. So don't waste your money and buy some expensive head because you don't want to stretch it. The wigs are very adjustable. I'll just show you really quick. In the back, 
where the tag and where it says Gabor, there are peel and stick. So the further away from the white tag makes it bigger. So if you have thick hair, you want to make the, the wig bigger. If you have fine hair, you want to make it smaller, you go inside. Now, they're very breathable. Look how my fingers go right through them. People always ask me if they're hot. They're not. And then they say, are they itchy? No. Super soft to the touch. That's going to be right at your hairline. So when you wash it, which you soak it for five minutes every few months with a little bit of shampoo, and then you uh, put it right on your wig stand, you let it air dry, it's back to fabulous. Now, what you're seeing now is taking long hair, twisting it in two ponytails, put a bobby pin on each ponytail, and you get a free wig cap with every wig. You're gonna take that, you're gonna tuck all your hair inside, doesn't matter how long or how thick it is, and then, bam, Gabor does the rest for you. No talent needed. Yeah, and you're seeing how she pops it on her head. So if you would like to, get, and by the way, we've got a show, we're gonna talk about this for an hour, and we have five different styles. The style that I'm wearing is actually the longest style in the show. So this this is gonna be coming up in, in a little bit, the style that I'm wearing. This is the one we're talking about right now. And uh, you know, when you look at how, I love how like cute and fun and sassy it is in the back. You see how it's almost like that PC. And in order for you, like this, if this is your hair, if you wanted this haircut, which by the way, it's adorable. I could see why I'd be like wait a minute I want that haircut you in order to get these pieces to come out like this the blow drying the touching up this the styling products and then you sleep on it okay wait a minute now it's flat now I got to go through that whole thing all over again wait a minute there's a zoom call even if you're like you know what I'm gonna get this way I'm gonna get my hair done like that but when there's a zoom call and I've got to be on it in three minutes I'm gonna pop this on and I'm gonna be good to go and I think uh, so many more women are turning to wigs because they don't want to spend an hour doing their hair. Well, that's just it. So even if you can find someone to give you this haircut, you have to have the talent to be able to manipulate <laughs> that blow dryer yes. and that round brush. And yes. I'm looking at Francine, and I've said this story a hundred times. Mm -hmm. Before the pandemic, when I was at the studio and I met Francine for the first time in the green room, I put the wig on her, which by the way, she did herself because you're in Florida and I'm in New Jersey right now. And she lit up like Times Square. And I was like, we're not even on air yet. And she's like, I don't care. I love the way I look. And it was so awesome to see that that is the feeling you're gonna get when you get this wig home. Look at her crown in the before. You yep. see how the scalp is showing? Yep. Most women most women complain up to me, including my mother, about that all the time. You're never gonna get that with this wig. And you know, you look at her smile, my grandmother, my mother, my, my birth mother, everybody always says, when my hair looks good, I feel good. And this is the answer. Yeah, and we also should talk about the price, Martino, because you've been a celebrity yeah. stylist in the hair business, working with the, you know, people have all the money in the world, let's be honest. So uh, most of us can't spend $50,000 for a wig. But that's how much Listen, some of those I, wigs <laughs> cost, right, Martino? I have, I have seen a wig go for $5,000 that I wouldn't put on my mother if you paid me. I mean, it's not how much it costs, it's who makes it, right? And when you have someone who's been around for 52 years, they know how to make a heat, friendly synthetic fiber that doesn't look synthetic. They know how to make one that's mm -hmm. adjustable so you don't have to worry about what size to buy. And they know how to make one that's breathable. So, you know, you nailed it on the head. It's not how much you spend, it is who makes it. <laughs> who makes it. And by the way, thank you for your calls and orders. The light gray is sold out in spirit. And I'll tell you, as we go through every every call, every style, the light gray will always be like, gotta have it. Speaking about beauty, free shipping and handling on all beauty. So all your favorite beauty brands, like Perlier and, you know, Longcomb and Too Faced and Corez and Pry and Tweaked, you name it. We've got all, so many different brands on, a, by the way, we have brands like Clinique and MAC that you don't even see on air, but we check out all the beauty on hsn.com. All of it is free shipping and handling. It is a special that we're doing right now. So I'm super excited for those of you who are jumping in and treating themselves to a wig. All right. We're we're gonna talk about the epiphany is our next style. So the epiphany, I think this is virtue, I know. And I know that that's this one. I think this is peace and this is epiphany right here. So let me kind of take it down here. So epiphany is a little bit longer. 
So it's longer as opposed to that PC flirty. See how it kind of comes in to the nape of the neck? Look how gorgeous, but you've got like that height up top and how Martina was talking about that crown. I know I have that too, that kind of cowlick where it looks like you've got like, you can see skin. It's almost like it looks like you have like thinning hair at the top because of the cowlick. Look how perfect that is every single time. Um, I, if I had to get back all the time I spent trying to make that cowlick go away and look how beautiful this is. And by the way, you can kind to zhuzh this a little differently depending on how you want it to look right martino absolutely this is a sought after style uh, another celebrity first name starts with chris people come in all the time they're like i want this i want this and it's another haircut that number one you need someone that's really talented to do and number two the maintenance it's a three-week haircut if you want it to continue to frame your face like that i mean Okay, Inger, it looks amazing on you. Look at that. Look at her ear, how it's tucked behind her ear. You cannot tell that it's a wig. Look at the shine. It looks like healthy, perfect hair. That volume in the crown, the hugging of the nape of the neck, the, the way it, it just contours her cheeks. I mean, girl, you look sexy. How do you feel? I, I feel wonderful. I mean, I love this <laughs> wig. I love, like you said, how it frames my face. The fact that is very versatile, so I can put it right behind my ear, or I don't have to, but I like it either way. I also like the fact that it hugs the back of my neck, because you know, some wigs you get, and it, that doesn't happen, and the, the wig just flips up in the back, and that's really horrible. So not with this wig, not with Gabor, that they just lay, it just lays right flat on the back of her neck. It's just beautiful. I, this is the dark brown, which I absolutely love, and I'm just gonna show you the light gray because this is just gorgeous. And I if love you the want color. the light gray, it's gonna go, and it's always going first, right? Everybody loves the yes. light gray. Yes. It is. It's so they huge. Do. Both my sisters love and wear the light gray too. Um, so I was in a big fashion show recently, and um, they couldn't decide which wig they wanted me to wear. So I had bought a few of them, and I bought the gray and the red and the black. So they had me wear the red and the gray. And let me tell you, it was just gorgeous, sweet. Uh, I just, I just like, they just love the fact that, that I could change everything. it up. And so here you go. Look at that. Look at that. that and it doesn't matter called? what age you are. It's <laughs> actually hot. Everybody's wearing it. All the young people. It doesn't matter. Yes. Six yeah, to true. whatever, 90. I don't know. <laughs> My niece put it on. That's why I said six. And we were just, <laughs> she said, Auntie Ingi, I want to wear it. And I said, hon, she said, please. I said, okay. <laughs> we had so you much know, fun. Helen, yeah. Helen, when somebody walks around with hair that color and that style, it's called rubberneck because you literally stop somebody in their tracks and they whip their head, they look at you and they say, I love your hair. That is the look of this wig, especially in that gray on Inga right now. She would be stopped. I don't care if she's in a restaurant, if she's in church, if she's in a mall, people are going to stop her and say, I love your hair. That's that look you're seeing right now. I love it. By the way, I do have some updates. So in the Epiphany, I've already got some limited <laughs> quantity. In the black, I only have two... 23 left 23 wow. in the black if you want the black there's only 23 left um how many do we have in the gray uh jared because i know the gray i have oh i have 80 in the gray that's what we're starting with so i love that that finally we we're because we we actually i we were going to have some different styles in the show martino and things were selling out so much that the nice folks at gabor had to bring us more new styles just for the show we can't i mean yes right it wigs are really kind of taking over and i know that wigs like maybe it was like a a certain like a, a, one culture would wear it and another you know i will say I, i'm not allowed to tell you which hosts wear wigs and which hosts don't <laughs> but i'm gonna count how many hosts wear wigs all the time S right now there's six hosts who wear wigs all the time and they're all different skin tones, all different nationalities, all different and you won't you don't even know it because once you have that freedom of not right. of not having to do your hair especially since here we do our own hair and makeup. So there's that. I mean, today I like I just threw my hair in a ponytail because you you don't you you, you don't realize like the freedom of like having this adorable wig that you never have like even if you just skip getting your roots done one time, uh, I don't know about you, but I don't think $120 covers even like uh, getting hair color in a cut, that, not where I go. So I'm just, I, I mean, around the country, I don't know, that seems like a very low price for a color with highlights and a cut and you know, baby lights, low lights, all that. 
You're, one time you get a Gabor wig, it's going to be worth it, right, Martino? Look, uh, look at her. Yes, look at her hair. I mean, just look at that. And what you're going to find, with like especially with Tessa looking at her, how beautiful she looks. When you get this home and you feel that empowerment in the mirror, you're going to start to have a wig collection. It's, you don't have to order the color that matches your hair. This is your chance to go blonde, to go gray, to, to be red. Because by the way, this Excel fiber that's proprietary to Gabor, it can never fade. So that means the gray wigs never turn that ugly yellow that can happen to gray hair, and the red will never wash out, and the blonde will never get brassy. So this is just like unbelievably too good to be true, you think, until you get it home, you put it on, and you say, wow. You change your earrings, you change your shoes, you change your lipstick color. Why not change your hair with ease and without damaging your hair? Yeah, and I'd love to go through the colors again. So here you're seeing the light blonde. Um, we've got it in, you know, you go a little darker. It's medium blonde. Then we have dark blonde. You see it's not just one color, like a helmet. Some wigs look like helmets. Brown blonde. We've got those beautiful bright blonde pieces and brown hair. I've got the light brown. Um, I've got the uh, medium brown, which is kind of like a beautiful chestnut color. Then we get a little darker for dar dark brown. And then we have a true black, which is... In this style, I only have a couple, like a dozen left. And then I've got medium red, which is so fun. And then we have the light red with more blonde in it, blonde and red. And then we have two grays. I've got the brown gray and then the light gray. So you're looking at these gorgeous colors and maybe you've always dreamed of being have, being a redhead. And you know, Martino, for years I, I did have red hair. And the, one of the reasons I stopped is it's a very hard color to keep in your hair. It just oh. rinsed out the drain every time I washed my hair, right? It does. It, and it doesn't matter how expensive a shampoo you use, that is the nature, or how good of a color brand you use, that is the nature of red hair. So when you look at the light red that has blonde highlights in it, if that was human hair, that red would bleed, the blonde would turn pink. I mean, train wreck city, but not with this fiber. It cannot fade. Look at Francine. It looks like her own hair just went to the salon and had a really professional hairdresser give it a really good blow dry. That's the look you're gonna get every day when you wear the wig. And I'm telling you, even in humidity, it can't frizz up or go flat. You get stuck in a little rain shower while you're walking into the grocery store. When it dries, it goes right back to what you're seeing right now on the right side of the TV screen. That split in the back of her head will never be there with the Gabor wig. And that is one of the number one complaints I get. Clients will say to me, doing hair 31 years, we see about 1,200 clients a week. They'll say, am I going bald? And I'm like, no, it's the growth pattern. It's the growth pattern. And unless you really blow it out with that round brush or use like the Forever Your Curl tool or something like that, you're always going to have it when you wake up in the morning, except now. This wig will never do that, ever. Never yeah. do that, and you're going to love it. We've got more styles to show. The item number is on your screen, 774-490. Um, also, we're doing flex pay, so you have three months to pay it off. We can't wait to send you your brand new wig. Each wig comes with a wig cap, but um, we do have extra wig caps that you can buy if you would like to. And we also have the wig stands. These stands, we sell them in, a, I believe it's a three pack, right? So I encourage you to be able to keep it. All right, so now we're gonna move on to the one I'm wearing. So, I mean, this is the length that I've been thinking about cutting my hair to. So I said, let me have, and let's go to HSN. Dot, uh, let's go to my Facebook. There, there I am. You can see it's like a little brighter. Should I go a little brighter with my hair? I have it blonde, but maybe, you know, it's, it's like a way to try out something. And people will say, um, oh, did you get your hair done? Did you get your, oh, you got bangs. I know you've been thinking about getting bangs for years. I, this is, this is like so fun. I, I like this one. It's a little bit, it's longer. It's actually the longest style that we have. And because of that, that you've got some versatility with it too. So I could pin it back here. I can put it behind my ears. I could do a headband. I know we, do we have any of those? Yeah, we've got these cute little headbands from like Locks in Maine, where you can do like a little headband. There's all sorts of, I mean, this is a pretty versatile wig. Absolutely, you can put it in an updo, you could put it in a bun. Mm -hmm. um, I, what I'm having right here is um, the shadow shaded root, which is so popular right now um, in the medium blonde. But yeah, you could do a lot with it. You can, in fact, somebody had emailed me earlier and asked me, can I take this to my salon and have it cut? Absolutely, if you wanna have more angles around your face, take it to your hairdresser, let them cut it. 
but many of you have asked for longer styles and that's hello why we brought it here today <laughs> look at you i'm sorry you're looking hotter and hotter honey Mm -hmm. I love that rooted look too. Yes, I love that. So it's so modern and up to date, that rooted look. And that's very hot now too. I like this color. You know, people would say, oh, that's not for me. But you know, sometimes you have to try something different, step out your box. And so that's what I did here. Just trying something different. And I like this because it brightens up my face. It's fresh, it's new. I love the way it moves. Mm. Wow, wow. That, <laughs> that's you know, a swing. This is what happens. That's a gut this swing. Is, this is what so happens, So I'm right? just going to show you another color, which I absolutely love too, the uh, medium red. So take that out of the box, just shake it. And I just want to show you again the breathability of it. That's why I can wear them all year round because, you know, it's not hot for me because it's so breathable. And um, I love that because I'm not going to be sweating in any kind of wig. Also, I'm not going to wear it. So... I love the fact that these, uh, I can breathe in them, you know, my head can breathe in it. And just look how. Ooh, look, I like that. Oh, Ooh, I like that. Gorgeous. And before I came out, I saw Tess in it and I thought, wow, Tess, you look beautiful. So you're gonna see her in a minute too, but I just wanted to say, look at that color. You know, if I had to keep dyeing my hair this color, because I love this color, I love wearing this dark red, medium red, pardon me, but um, I would ruin my hair. Yeah. And I'm not about to do that. So this is a wonderful alternative for me. And look at that move. I love that it's, color. It's amazing. I love, that's amazing. It's amazing. Isn't that amazing. lovely? I just love it. You know, when, you're, when a woman gets her hair done in the salon, I have to tell you, it's so funny. They could walk in in the worst mood. Whatever happened. The kid was late to school. The dog missed the pee pad. Whatever it is. The minute their hair looks good, all of that goes away. They get like a hair attitude. So when your hair looks good, you just have confidence to feel better. And by the way, I'm going to throw uh, Inger under the bus. When she started being one of my models, she was single and ready to mingle. Now that she started wearing wigs, she got a man, she got married. So I'm not saying wearing a wig is going to get you a husband, but it worked for her. <laughs> So you got a husband because of the wigs Martina was claiming, Ingerborg. Let's go to you and see if you have anything to speak to in your defense. So in my defense, so I was walking in the rain, and uh, my husband, he had saw me before, but he didn't say anything to me. Oh, he did say hello. He did say hi. But that was it. Well, my hair got soaking wet in the rain, and he was like, well, can I help you? And he says, your hair is just gorgeous. Your hair looks beautiful and you're soaking wet. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I actually didn't tell him like for six months that it was not my hair. Oh, <laughs> but he likes my own part. hair too. He likes both. He said either or whatever you like is fine with me. He loves it though. He loves the wigs. Yeah, it's awesome. so fun. That's it is awesome. fun. I love, you know, I and Martino, I popped in one of the, the headbands, and I, I like the lo the ones that are a little longer because there's so much yeah. versatility, and honestly, it looks, I mean, so much like your real hair. It's, it's it, 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 the more, the, yeah, right? It, well, listen, you look beautiful, and I love the adorable headband that you're wearing, but summer's coming, and it's going to be humid out, and this wig will never frizz. So you can go to the beach or the boardwalk if you're up here in New Jersey, or you can even go to Las Vegas, and your hair's still gonna look fantastic on that cruise ship. Your hair's gonna look fantastic. Look at her. I mean, I keep stuttering because I am so impressed, even though I've been doing this for years, these models are doing it themselves. I am 1,200 miles away from them. I haven't touched them and since the pandemic. They're doing it themselves and they look amazing. You look so beautiful, Tess. You look, you look great. Yeah, I, I, I love the, again, these colors that, I think she's wearing the brown blonde, Tess. Is that what you're wearing? Yeah, the brown yeah. blonde. I, I, you know, it's just really, really gorgeous. And you're right, all that coloring, it does damage your hair. You're trying to grow your hair out. Even if you're trying to grow out your natural hair, Oof. just wearing a wig so you're not, you know, kind of torturing your hair to help it grow out, right, Martino? Well, definitely, especially now, you know, a lot of people have pandemic hair, we're calling it. You know, they didn't cut, they haven't colored their hair in so long, and maybe they've been wanting to grow out their gray, or maybe they've been wanting to change and try something new. This is a chance without, I mean, to make your hair go gray, let's say you've been coloring it like a chestnut brown, now you want to go gray. Number one, it costs a fortune, it takes forever, and it's not the safest and healthiest thing for your hair. These are all great transitions. This is a way for you to try to be red without, you know, if you're blonde and you, that's a big step, people that, 
blonde want to go red? I try to talk him out of it. I said, because what if you don't like it? You can't go back to blonde overnight. But with this wig, you can change from blonde to gray to red to brown to blonde brown. It doesn't matter because you can just do it in a second with no damage. All right, I've got some updates. Um, if you want the black, I know we've got very... 30 left, oh my goodness, there's only 30 wow. left. However, the most popular is the light gray. And finally, we like got more in the light gray because every single time, right, it would sell out like that. We weren't even able mm -hmm. to talk about it. But look look at this, look what's going on here, Francie, with the longer hair. To me, she looks like, I think it look, makes her look younger immediately. It does, absolutely. I mean, she looks beautiful in anything she wears, but she definitely looks younger in this wig. There's no question no about question it. About it. Yeah, I love it. I love it. And it's so easy and she doesn't have to worry about, all right, I got to blow dry my hair and, st you know, style it and everything. And you know what? A lot of us, uh, you know, a lot of people are working on like Zoom calls. You've got a Zoom call for like mm -hmm. maybe like an hour, but then you've got, oh, okay, so then you're going to go to the gym. Well, I'm going to spend two hours doing my hair for an hour call and then for the rest of the day, should I just like sit there because I spent so long on my hair? It really gives, I think, women freedom, you know, in we're both married and like nothing's more irritated when I say to my husband, I'm gonna get ready and then two hours oh, later Lord. and then he's like, tell oh. me when you're about to walk out the door and he gets oh. up, goes like this and then walks out the door, right? Ingrid, you know what oh I'm my saying? Gosh. <laughs> my husband's always sitting and waiting and I thought, you know what, I'm just gonna wear the wig. He says, whatever. <laughs> right. All of them look good. How Put on those wigs on. <laughs> <laughs> right, exactly. So, I love, a, I want to just say that, uh, Helen, I love that um, blonde on you. But also, I would love to see you in this one with the, um, the, the roots. Yeah, this is a darker blonde. It, it what what color is that too. called? Um, this is called um, dark blonde. Oh, it's called dark blonde. Yes. Okay, Martino, because the dark blonde is a rooted blonde? It's mm -hmm. shadow shade medium blonde, actually. Shadow it's shade what? medium blonde. Shadow it's the one that shade I have here. medium blonde. Yeah. So oh, you okay. see that okay. root? Yeah, see that root? Oh yeah, because um, they that, don't have that rooted blonde in all the styles. Uh, no, just correct. Just... But this rooted blonde is very hot right now, and it costs a lot more money to have your roots melted out than it does just to cover your gray. So again, saving a lot of money, but you're trending. You're looking hot. And if I could give you from a man's perspective, okay, my girlfriend and my grandmother are the same. They take forever to get ready. They change their outfit 7,000 times and their hair 7,000 times. This is a game changer for both of them. My mother as well. My mother won't even leave the house without her wig. And the one coming up that she wears is the Virtue. You'll see that in a minute. But uh, there's the medium uh, rooted blonde The medium blonde, right blonde rooted is the one that Ingrid had. My producer is just clarifying. So if you want that rooted blonde, it's called medium blonde rooted. It's right there on your screen. Thank yeah. you so much, Jared, because I know that maybe we got different information here in the studio and Martino at home. But yeah, we take a while to get ready, Martino. We get it. <laughs> who, are you, who are you telling? Who are you telling? <laughs> I know you've seen it in action. <laughs> Oh, Lord, help me, man. God. But my mom, for, for real, not kidding, you know, she will not leave the house without her wig at all. I don't even remember the last time I've seen my mother without her wig. And my mom will be 84 in June, and um, she was very self-conscious of her hair as it started to get thin. You know, as we get older, we lose the keratin in our hair. It's just natural. And when your gray comes in, your hair looks thinner than it actually really is. So um, my mom used to come to the salon every Wednesday morning. She was my first client. And now that she has Gabor, uh, she has tons of them, by the way. Um, she hasn't been to the salon and since the pandemic. Well, happy birthday to your mom in June. And that's, you. you know, anything that makes you feel <laughs> confident. I mean, why not? Yeah. And it's not, ex not expensive. It's not expensive. No way. You know? Not at all, no way. I mean, you can spend no $100 way. on a blowout one time, right, Martino? Uh, easily and you could also spend a hundred dollars on a wig that looks like it's from party city for a yeah. halloween costume <laughs> well. this you know uh, pardon my language but this with this wig just looks like natural healthy hair and that's the difference when you buy from a company that is the wig authority right 52 years of research and development they've been around that's why the wigs don't look plastic that's why you can flat iron and curl them that's why they don't get frizzy when you go out in the rain or the humidity 
That's why they're, they are not hot. That's why they're breathable. That's why they're adjustable. That's why they don't itch. I mean, I could go on for an hour of all the features and benefits of getting a wig from Gabor that's been around for 52 years. Right, and the genesis of the company was glamour. It was yes. glamour, yes. right, Martino? Yes. It wasn't like, okay, oh, I don't feel like doing my hair. It was like, I want to look better. I want to look more Absolutely. glamorous, right? Absolutely, Eva Gabor, when in 1969, I think it took one year for it to be the largest wig manufacturer in the world. It only took a year. And you know, this is not the wig from like, that you think about when you were like a kid and you could pick out a wig. Like I go to church, I'm like, oh, that's a wig, that's a wig, that's a wig. No, this is not, I should say my grandmother's wig. This is a wig that every woman, any age can wear. And by the way, People put extensions in their hair all the time. Why? Because they don't like their own hair the way it is. That's why people are wearing wigs now. And again, if you flip through the channel and you're watching TV, if you look closely, you're going to see more people wear wigs than you ever would have thought in your life. But what's awesome is you're not going to be able to pick out a Gabor one. Yeah, and we'll show my before and after. I mean, you, you don't feel like doing your hair. You throw it in a ponytail, or you put on a glamorous, perfectly styled, expertly colored, you know, you know, t wig. And then you see, you see it right there. That's on my Helen Keeney HSN Facebook page. We we shot these pictures before the show. I'm excited for those of you who try wigs for the first time. And by the way, it's it's not. This is not a difficult thing to do. If you can put you know a hat on. You just basically, there's two tabs right here and you just center them and then that's all it is to do it. I will say it takes five minutes. I had two, two three minutes at the beginning of the show so it took me a couple more minutes. I would say it takes five minutes. It does not take three minutes, <laughs> it takes five minutes. All right, um, I also wanna just take a, like, a pause and talk about something that uh, is free from HSN and QVC. It's our streaming services. It's everything you love about shopping here and so much more. We'd love for you to watch original content, live shows, lots of familiar personalities, and some new faces. So you're going to find a lot of great products, amazing brands, and all sorts of deals all the same time while hearing about the stories that you love. And you can also catch all the shows you might have missed. And guess what? It's all free. Where can you find it? Fire TV, Roku, LG, Xfinity 1X, Xfinity Flex, and we're going to be launching on even more platforms. So stand by for that. Uh, discover wh where shopping comes along live and it's on HSN and QVC on our streaming services. So love that. And you know, we're talking about getting ready for spring fashion. We're going to go to virtue and that's, that's this wig right here. I know we all, this is what we all think about as we come into spring. Should I cut my hair short? Should I cut, you know what? Should, don't we all do that Ingeborg, right? We all think it's yeah. springtime. I want to go short. Mm -hmm. This to me, and I actually, I know I have pictures on my uh, Instagram page of me in this wig in the gray. And uh, yes, because this is one of my favorite looks. So this is virtue. Virtue is incredibly flattering and sexy. You think about, oh, long, long hair is sexy. Virtue to me is the sexiest style of the entire five that we have in the show. Because it it's very sleek and it does something, it shows your beautiful face. Uh, and at, at $119, the wigs, you know, we've got flex pay. Get, give this a try. I've actually worn this in gray because imagine trying to keep that beautiful silver platinum gray. Oh, look at you finding that picture, Sharon. I'm impressed. <laughs> nice, so here nice. I am in this wig. This honestly was one of my all-time favorite wig looks that I've ever done on HSN, and it's this wig. Because honestly, I probably wouldn't cut my hair and dye it like that because I wouldn't, it, 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 I wouldn't be able to keep it up and it wouldn't always have that color. But popping on that wig, I, I looked at that long and hard and went, I want that. It's unbelievable. She looks amazing. It's incredible. And can we talk about, look at that before and after, okay? Her beautiful textured hair is gorgeous. However, if she wanted to straighten it and wear it like the wig, the amount of heat and time that it would take to transform that, let's ask her herself, how long would it take? How long will it take, Ingerborg? He wants to know oh, for gosh, you to like too long. for you to you know straighten it, yes. style it, straighten you know, it. Get, you got to get it cut. You got a perfect. Up. Oh, she's going with the gray. I can't the wait. The texture is just too much time for me because I used to do that when I first started here. I was like doing my hair all the time, curling it, hot. Or, it's too much. 
not only time consuming, but damaging to my hair because working constantly changing my hair, running from one show to the mm -hmm. next, and then running to maybe do a runway show or filming a commercial, oh no. Breathability, yes. Style, yes. Fun, yes. <laughs> All right, I got some updates. Go ahead and put that on. We'll keep the camera on you. Black just sold out. Light gray, I have 18 left. So, wow. Yeah, because this light gray in this one, I'm telling you, it. I knew, I knew it would be fly out there. And by the way, we get more quantity in this because you, this is your favorite. That's how quickly these sell out. I, I, I'm That's just, amazing. I'm like, that looks insanely sexy on you. So it's, it's your beautiful. favorite is my favorite too. So when I'm going to auditions or for a nurse or a doctor, this is what I wear. <laughs> really? Yes, I do because um, I can style it the way I want. So I'll style it like very conservative, you know, flatten out like this, this kind of look with my glasses, right? And then when I want to have more fun, I just sass that thing up like this, put the bangs a little bit wispy, maybe put it like this in front. And look how different that is. Just in a wow. few seconds, yes. I'm making it look wow. completely, completely different. different yeah. I like the fact that it's so versatile. And I don't know if you noticed, but when I wore the dark brown, I had it part on this side. So I'm, this is the versatility. You can just put your fingers, move it over to the other side. And, and look at that, a different look again. Just change it up and make it your own. That's what I love about it. I love it. Hey, I Mar think it looks fantastic. Martino, sorry, if she got her hair cut like that, how long would that haircut last? No more what than four weeks. And by, th by three weeks, it's going to start to look shabby because, like I said, your hair grows a half inch a month. So when something is that precision, that we call that that sexy boy cut, it's so precision. If it grows out a quarter inch, it's already going to get flat on top. It's already going to look straggly at your nape of your neck. And it's just, listen... You need a wig, you need a wig, you need a wig. That's what I said the other day when we were selling out of wigs left and right, because if you want to have that beautiful look, and again, I go back to Tessa, her hair is beautiful long, but if she wanted to cut it short and change that color, number one, it's going to cost a fortune and her maintenance is going to be overbearing and overwhelming. So why put yourself through that? And I'm saying that as a salon owner for 31 years, this just makes more sense. Yeah, and it, Virtue, I mean, one of my all-time favorite. We've only got one more style left in the show. The show is flying by. Look, look at that. Look at, look at that perfect, you know what it looks like? It looks like a perfect haircut. I'm standing, you know, I'm in the same studio as her. I cannot tell that that's a wig, Martino. No way. Cannot tell. No way. No way. And you won't be able to tell because the construction of the wig, that's why I keep saying, you're, when you can tuck it behind your ear and not see the construction of a wig, that's how you know you hit the jackpot. When you see those colors in front of you, mm -hmm. each color that you're looking at is consists of seven to 11 different varieties of that color. Because what happens with a poorly made wig, it looks like shoe polish or it just looks like, you know, flat, fake hair. This is just unbelievably well-made. The shine really mimics true, healthy, natural, God-given hair. And the colors are just simply extraordinary. Yeah, beautiful. And and yeah, I mean, I could go through the colors live because they they really, they come alive. So this one is called Light Blonde. Look at all the different, look at all the different um, colors where you're seeing like, you know, beautiful like platinum and ambers. And it's just, I mean, this looks so natural. So that's called Light Blonde. This is Medium Blonde. So you can see the difference where you've got these, these pieces of red in here with the blonde that give it a little bit more of a warmth than the Light Blonde. Then we go to dark blonde, which is kind of the color that my, my hair that I'm doing right now, it's basically dark hair with like blonde highlights in it. And, and, but, but it's kind of a, a very, very, you know, kind of me darker color, like overall. But if you want more of a contrast, there's brown blonde. And this brown blonde, and I want to turn it around, you see how you've got these pieces, these, you know, kind of chunky pieces of blonde hair, like right here. So you really, look at that. So you're seeing like chunky highlights, and that's brown blonde. So I, I like the chunky highlights. So if you love that look, that's brown blonde. Light brown is again, more like baby lights, where you've got, it just looks like it's a very, subtle light and dark in it that is light brown this is medium brown you're getting into like a little bit of the chestnut family where you're getting like chestnut warmer highlights with the brown then we're going to get to the dark dark colors so we have dark brown and black and we'll show these next to each other so you can see the difference where 
you got the, the dark brown is just slightly lighter, slightly lighter. And this is a true black. And then we get into the reds. Reds are always popular too, because again, it is a very hard, hard color to do. So the medium red, you've got, you know, darker auburn colors and then strawberry blonde highlights in it. Um, but then this color, light red, as Martina was saying, would be one of the hardest color for a professional stylist to do because you've got to wash your hair and have the red that's been colored not bleed into the blonde. Uh, and it would be almost, it's almost impossible to do this blonde, red, strawberry kind of, um, and, and let me turn it to the side here. We really, I mean, I, I think this is gorgeous. And this is like one of the reasons to get a wig is look at, look at how beautiful and natural that looks. That's blonde and red together. That, and right, Martino, this is one of the hardest combos. It's, it, it won't work. You can do it, but I guarantee you within a week, you're going to start seeing pink in the hair. Yeah. And if you go to the grocery store and you see a woman with red and blonde, you're going to see pink in her hair because it's impossible for that red not to bleed. Mm. But remember, with Gabor, the colors never bleed. They never fade. They never change. It's that color for life. I love it. All right. And then we have medium gray. And medium gray is, it's not a bright gray. It's, it's a, you know, kind of a brown gray. So that is, and actually it's called brown gray. Sorry, brown gray. And you can see there's gray in that. But it's not, it's not like that bright platinum. And then, sadly, in the Virtue, the light gray is completely sold out now. But I'll show you the color because you're going to other styles. And that is that, you know, platinum, can't get it in a bottle style. But look, I mean, I, I think that this one, to me, is like a very sexy look. No, it definitely is. And it's instant perfect hair. Look at her before, beautiful. But look at her after, stunning because it's hard for her to be able to manipulate a round brush, a blow dryer, curling iron, all this stuff. And what happens is most of the time, women get frustrated. They think their hair won't hold a curl, their hair won't this, their hair won't that. So they just don't do it. And to your point earlier, they put it in a ponytail. And then when you have your hair in a ponytail or your hair's not done, nobody stops you and says, wow, I love your hair. And who doesn't want to hear that? When you hear that, it boosts your confidence. When you look in the mirror, I remember during the pandemic, I was doing posts about do your hair even though you're not leaving the house. It'll keep you in a better mood. When you look good, you feel mm -hmm. good. I mean, it is a fact, you know? And she doesn't have that split in the back of her hair. She's got a big smile on her face and it's forever. It's forever. It's, it's withstands heat, wind, rain, snow. The only thing that could change the shape of these wigs is heat at 350 degrees. That's it. And by the way, they're e super easy to travel with. I know a lot of people are kind of doing some traveling for, you know, and maybe you're like, maybe you're going to go back on a cruise. You're going to, and, and you want to like, okay, you're swimming all day. You're in the sun. Now it's time to go to a fancy dinner in the theater. Do you stop your vacation for a couple hours? Okay, wait, I got to wash. I got to get the set. I got to, no, you pop this on. You pop this on. And you know what? You can have your hair be a different color every day of the week, you know? Uh, it's just, look how spectacular. This is the light blonde in the, in the Virtue. I, I just think it's it's almost like a, a pixie. I like going like this with this style, like bringing it forward on my face. And it's just, it's gorgeous. I know that we have a picture of me in this wig in a color that just sold out. So, sorry. We've got one more style that we're going to go to. And, uh, I'm, and, you know, you can go to hsn.com and see but before we move on let's go to our website because we've got one more day on free shipping and handling on all of our beauty items so all of your favorite beauty brands and some brands that you may not even know that we have here at hsn like mac and clinique so many brands of course we have Longcomb, we have tweaked we have it i mean we've got so many amazing brands uh, perlier corez too faced all my favorite eyeshadows are in too faced skin cosmetics beautiful cosmetics and skin care um, um, Doll 10, love that concealer. You can't live without that concealer. So, and of course, uh, Signature Club A, beautiful beauty. So check that out on hsn.com. All right, so here is our final style. And this is, this is a newer style, a newer cut. So it's called the Peace Wig. And you've got, 
this kind of a bob, this perfect bob, which, you know, I don't know if you've ever had your hair. I've had my hair cut in a bob. You got to blow dry it to make it just absolutely perfect. It's like one of these, it looks simple, but believe me, I've had my hair cut like this and it takes a long time to get that perfect styling. And then you've got the versatility of some length. So you can put it behind your ear. You're able to, you know, kind of judge it. And of course, Ingrid Borg is wearing it right now and she looks gorgeous. That's the dark, medium brown gray, brown gray, right? Brown gray. Yeah. So Inger, tell us about this one. Oh, I love this one. First of all, I love the color, right? And the fact that another time is versatile too. So look how I feathered it to the side, right? And then it just drops down. So you can do that. You can put it behind your ear like that. Another different look. You can put this one behind your ear so you can have them both that way. So, I mean, that's, I just love that because you can just change it up the same wig, making it look different. Now, if you want to tease it up a little and puff it up, I mean, we can do that too. Mm, just saying. <laughs> so you can do so many things with this. So I'm just going to change it out really quick so I can show you the medium red. Shake that thing out, right? And we're going to put that on really one, two, three. And that's on and just going to center those tabs, right? And finger style it. I'm styling this one just a little bit different. I'm not gonna feather it to the side, just let it hang and put it right behind my ear and I'm ready to go. Isn't that amazing? I mean, Ooh, and look at the, the movement that's, that's of it. That's it, that's the shot, that I is mean, the shot. This is, it's just this is an epic beautiful. I'm sorry, <laughs> there's a little delay in my ear. This is an epic haircut, okay? This started with my late friend, Bedell Sassoon, and it has never, ever, ever, ever gone out of style. I love how it's a little disconnected, meaning that it's a little longer uh, in the front on that one side, which just really hugs that chin line, hugs that neckline, and it is just the most poised, polished, sexy look on the planet. I am so partial to this haircut. Um, I've been doing it for 31 years, and I'll probably be doing it for another 31 if God gives me that much life left in me. It's just, you just see how it frames that face, and this stacked back, you want, look around, just challenge yourself to look for people with that natural haircut. You need to be a master stylist to cut someone's hair and look like this. I mean, Tess looks beautiful in it. It is just a flawless haircut. You are guaranteed to get compliments. Again, that rubber neck, you stop people in their tracks and they're gonna say, wow, I love your hair. And you're gonna have to get used to it. Because you're going to be like, oh my gosh, do I say it's a wig? Do I not say it's a wig? But trust me, you're going to get lots of compliments. Yeah, I mean, this looks so fun. And, you know, I do know that styling this look is not easy, right, Martino? It no, looks simple, no. doesn't it? But you've got to get that height in the crown, that perfect, you know, round brush, getting it going underneath. And I don't know about you, but, like, you know, you go outside and it's humid, and then one side kicks out everything. You wear a Gabor wig, your hair's going to look perfect, just absolutely perfect every single time. That is the truth. And I'm telling you, like you said, you may think it, look, it looks simple to blow that out, but it's not. And you can ask anyone that you know that has that, that angled, you know, that bob. And uh, it's a lot of work. And this will always look perfect. Always. <clears throat> Yeah, absolutely perfect. No, no, no roots growing out. No, you know, this no style. Like, oh, okay, the curl fell out. Oh, wait, I lost the height in the top. Oh, I'm sorry. Or I need like, my neck shaved. How about that? I need my <laughs> neck shaved, my hairline shaved in two weeks. You know, you don't have to have any of that anymore. Right. None of that. None of that maintenance. Now, the the brown blonde is the most limited here. So there's only five left in the brown blonde. And that's the one I showed you with a brown blonde that had the chunky highlights to it. This would, oh, this is definitely a good style for the, those chunky highlights. Oh, definitely, absolutely. This wig looks great in every single color that you can imagine. Because again, you're hugging your face. You're hugging your neckline. A lot of women like this because women are very self-conscious from what I see in the salon of their neck as they get older. This is a very youthful look. I don't care if you're 18 or you're 84, this is gonna look good on anybody. Yeah, and by the way, sadly I have an update. The brown blonde just sold out. 
So Francine looks so, I mean, these look all, every single one of these looks so good, Francine, in this one. It's just really, really beautiful. And I like the versatility. And you know, maybe she wants to have like a little more length and growing out her hair that she has now short. Uh, and you know, I don't want to wait four years. I want, you know, right, Martino? Absolutely, and um, again, it's a true story. The day I met Francine in Tampa, Florida was probably four years ago or more, and I was in the green room, we had just met, I put the wig on her, and she lit up like Times Square, and I remember saying, we're not even on, on air yet, and she goes, I don't care, I love the way I look, and that was real. That wasn't salesman, that wasn't selling something, that was me and my model having a moment that I knew that I gave her confidence by putting that wig on. Here we are years later, during a pandemic, I'm in Jersey, she's in Florida, she did it all by herself, she's happy, she looks beautiful, and that's what you can expect too when you get this home. It's just, hands down, you're gonna be a 10, that's it. Yeah, I mean, this is really just a kind of like something to jump into. I think a lot of yes. women have been wearing wigs their whole lives and other women are like, you know what? Maybe I'm gonna give that a try. You know, like I have an aunt or my sister, my cousin, someone I work with wears a wig. Why, why don't I just see that? Um, let's take a look at Ingerborg. She's got she's got this style a little bit behind her ear in the piece style. I mean, I, I love that red color on you too. Wow, wow. Beautiful. I love it. Beautiful. Ingrid, is this hot? Is this a hot wig, oh, would you abs say? Absolutely not, because if it, it is, I will not be wearing it. Because when I first started wearing wigs, <laughs> I went to the wig store and I bought a wig, and let me tell you, I was sweating when I came out there. <laughs> the sweat was dripping out. They were like, you need to go take care of that. And I was like, that's not gonna happen ever again. So I was really glad when I <clears> found <throat> these wigs that they're so breathable. I like the fact that I can wear them all year round, and I do. And I do wear my own hair, but I wear the wigs a lot and I love them. I like this style, I love this classic look, but I also love that, look how modern and up-to-date wow. that is. Yeah. Love simple, it. Love changing it. it up, just a simple thing by yes. tucking it behind your ear. It's just really elegant, it's classic, and it's up-to-date and it's modern, and I love that. And this color, it's, oh, the medium red. It's to stunning. die for. I, I it's love to die the, for. Um, the light brown on um, Francine, she looks stunning. It's there, just absolutely gorgeous. So yeah. a little education on wigs, Helen, a little, just a little quick education. Yeah. If, you're, if you buy a wig that's not heat friendly, those are the ones that look plastic, right? And even some of the heat friendly ones if, that are not made well, they, they can look plastic. But I'm using my flexible hold hairspray on all of these. So if I wanted this to be a little bit flatter, I could use one of my flat irons on it. If I wanted to put a beach wave in it, I would use Forever Your Curl for me and Paula Abdul that's on HSN. But these are just like your own hair. You don't have to be afraid to use your hairspray on it. You don't have to be afraid to use your flat iron, your curling iron, your blow dryer, if you choose to change it. Again, you don't have to look at Tess. Her style is literally straight out of the box and put on her head. She didn't have to do anything. Maybe she used a little hairspray. I'm not there. I don't know. But when she shakes her head, it moves like real hair. It flows like real hair. And she looks very, very, very sexy right now. I love it, I love it. I actually would love to do a close up of the inside. I pop my wig off to show you how you adjust it uh, so that we can do it. I mean, because everybody's got a different size head, so there's these little tabs. And yep. with um, this hook and loop closure and you adjust it on the inside, um, so give it a little shake, but Martino, thank you so much. I want to thank all the models, friends, and, and, and Ingerberg, of course, <laughs> yes. amazing. Martino, fantastic. Nice. Uh, love thank these you. wigs. Thank you. Thank you so much. All right, stay tuned. I've got Patricia Nash coming up. The scarf that I've been wearing, beautiful handbags, wallets, my charm bracelet. So stay tuned. I'll see you in a sec. Global Chic is all about fashion freedom, new fabrics, patterns, and soft silhouettes with spicy details. So be free. Iman Global Chic, only on HSN. Our HSN price is a great value that we bring to you every day. We work hard and have the buying power to make sure it's a value that you'll love. So go ahead, treat yourself with the confidence to buy now at the HSN price.
Well, I'm so glad you're joining us here at HSN. My name is Helen Keeney, and we're gonna jump into an hour of gorgeous Patricia Nash handbags. We're showing you hsn.com with the amazing event that we're continuing on, which is free shipping and handling to all beauty, which is incredible. So I love that when we've got all these shipping specials and fun things going on, but <clears throat> If you 